The underbody of the Cadillac ATS rewrites the book on how you design a car for aerodynamics. They've done a more complete job of closing off openings and smoothing out the underbody than I've ever seen on any production car. Here's Larry Craig, the engineering program manager on the ATS, pointing out some of the details. John, I wanted to uh, just review a little bit of the uh, ATS's underbody here and uh, really highlight uh, how our engineers have uh, paid attention to detail in the underbody to deliver an aerodynamic, uh, I'll call it the side that you don't see, but what engineers say is the best side of the car. And as you can see, we've uh, got extensive use of belly pans, which provide a laminar or airflow underneath the vehicle. We've got only deflectors at the tires. Normally you would have an air dam. That's been eliminated because we're looking at uh, allowing the air to flow under the car, flow through the car, and then back out providing not only you know balancing lift and, and, and dive of the vehicle at, at speeds. We do use deflectors again at the, the wheels. I think one of the highlights and the attention to detail that I can mention is even the aero covers that we have on our rear suspension links. Uh, that uh, provides a drag count reduction of you know 0.01 and uh, you know that level of detail delivers the fuel economy that uh, we've shown uh, for the two and a half liter at uh, 33 EPA on the highway. Um, these shields also uh, serve as a, a dual purpose. Some are plastic in key areas where we want uh, acoustic and noise reduction. We've used the uh, different materials uh, which dampen the uh, road noise and uh, not only you know, serve a dual purpose uh, for performance. You know, I really like those plastic covers on the bottom of the suspension links in the rear suspension. I've never seen anyone go to that detail to improve underbody aerodynamics. And I especially like how they closed off underneath the front and rear fascias. Pretty good stuff. Cadillac says the ATS has a coefficient of drag of 0.29. That's pretty good for such a short car. It's easier to get better drag numbers with a longer car because that allows the aero guys to manage the air better. Why? Because plants need water to grow. Because baseball's played in the summer. Oxygen and hydrogen. Because I forgot to get a receipt. Why? Why not? Why? Why don't you go ask your dad? Do Sonata drivers know something you don't? The Sonata from Hyundai.